Uh, where Guys, I... that's a dragon. Yeah. The dragon's talking to me. Are those like scales, or does he have a beard, or what is that? I think oh. it's supposed to be a scale beard. He's a wise old man dragon, so he's got a beard. Okay. He's the Dumbledore of dragons. <laughs> yeah. Hello, yeah. this is Game for Looters. We're playing Spyro. Spyro the Dragon yeah. on the PS1. Are they? We're by the PS. Via the PS3. No, sh we're, we're being authentic. We're playing on a proper PS1. No, we're not. With a proper PlayStation format CD-ROM. No, we're not. Oh no! Was that a laser beam? Oh no! <laughs> he just bails. <laughs> <laughs> you know, fuck this! I'm <laughs> out. In the later games, he's voiced See, by... Tom. This is what I miss about old games. They just get straight into it. Yeah. Like, no messing about with half-hour cutscenes. Yeah. It's just like, no, stuff's okay. getting messed up. Were you not ten minutes ago telling me how much you love Metal Gear? <laughs> <laughs> That's isn't an that, exception. Yeah, isn't that just cutscenes? Yes. Oh, Metal Gear's glorious. It's so... Oh. Oh. Let's open up the Metal Gear wiki right now. Mm -hmm. I just want to... I don't want to. We're going to go through all the characters... <laughs> And then all the oh, oh. the snake, Solidus, snake, yeah. snake, snake, all, all snake, the snakes. Oh, so, so was snake like a last name? Ah, oh, that's his. That's his code name. But all the other, but all the other snakes are his sons. Are uh, we trying to hundred, no, just a sec. Are we trying to hundred percent this? Uh, not really. Yeah, sure. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, alright. Mm. I suppose this is within an era when you can actually do that. Yeah. I don't know, we can just... Oh, you, can't, shit. You, you can't swim in this game, are you? Oh, shit. <laughs> I this, forgot. This is back before you could swim in games. Yeah. Um, I don't know, we'll just get to the end of it, I suppose. Yeah. Okay, then. It's just a pretty standard, just, you know, going to levels kind of game. Yeah. You go through the portals. Wow, going to levels. Yeah, going, going to levels. I had forgotten that games did that. Yeah, yeah. I don't think you can control the camera in this one either. Uh, I think it's um the shoulder buttons. Okay. Me remember, this is back for DualShock. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the, the bad old days. Oh, uh, yeah. Alright. Yeah, I cannot remember this game whatsoever. Yeah. I think it's a fire breathing. Oh, it's no. so colourful. Yeah. Remember when games used to be for kids? Yeah. <laughs> Not really. Back before you were Call of Duties. Yeah, but you don't count, Nathan. You have, like, a baby sister who, like, plays kid games. <laughs> what are you going to say, like, he, doesn't, he didn't have a child? <laughs> <laughs> well, he probably doesn't remember it, because he died. What? And he, then he was resurrected oh, by witches. That's what did, happened in my brain. Did you just kill Gandalf? I think so. Yeah, well. I can remember the um, what levels game? being really short, but like having a lot yeah. in them. Yeah, but there's like a good, what, 30 levels in this? I'm not sure, actually. Stop applying the standards of today to, to games from... Son of a bitch. <laughs> who was doing that? The big... The uh, Gandalf. No, who was applying today's standards to this Oh, you yeah, guys. You're like, oh, it doesn't look good. And... I said it was colourful. That was things. my comment. <laughs> <laughs> it was colourful. Yeah, How is that an insult? That's, that's just because you're high. <laughs> I am absolutely <laughs> Back when they had, cheat, they had cheat code hotlines. Oh, yeah. You bet. I want to say that in the later games, Spyro is voiced by like Elijah Tom Wood Kenny. or something. Is it Tom Kenny? Tom Kenny. It's Tom from... Kenny in this, right? No, it was on um, number two and three. It was voiced by someone else. In oh no, scenario. sorry. Elijah Wood voices the the bad Spyro. <laughs> no, the the dragonfly. Nah. No. David Spade did. David Spade did the um, dragonfly. No, this is Elijah very Wood. big name people. No, you're lying for a Spyro too, game. Uh, Look at that. Elijah Wood would do everything. This is back before he was um Lord of the Rings money. Yeah. Elijah Wood did the voice of Spyro. In the, like, the PS2 era ones. Oh, okay. There's PS2 Spyro games? Yeah. We didn't talk about those. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, good call. About four bloody Skylanders. Do you just like, walk up to them and then they're okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you know, like, real life. 
That's exactly how to save people in uh, when a house is burning down. It's, it's an open world game. Okay. <laughs> it's an open world game. <laughs> it doesn't have loading screens. I mean, it does, but yeah. <laughs> loading and, and screens are um, like you're traveling to worlds. Mm. Like, see, that's the end of the level now. <laughs> that's all. Yep. I can remember the. Um, to be fair, first. it's the first level. Yeah. True. What's that? Free life. Extra life. Right. Remember when games just have lives? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What games have lives now? Um, um, I'm pretty sure there is actually a few. But... Name three. <laughs> three. Three modern games that have lives. Uh, Ooh, what's down here? I can't even name three modern games. <laughs> That's very bad of you. Mm. The last game I purchased was um, Mafia 3. <laughs> These guys. Is that any good? Played that. It's, uh... It's, it's not good. <laughs> it's, it's not good, but it sort of has a charm about it that I like. Uh, Ethan, stop just rolling. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot you could do that. Yeah, you're, you're not on fire, okay? Oh, hang on. No, you need a key for it. <laughs> um, because yeah, things don't have lives anymore. No, I'm just really struggling to find. Even think of even one. Mario Maker doesn't have lives. <laughs> don't they like have a hundred life run or something like that? Like an option? I don't know. No, it's just it's permadeath, isn't it? Yeah, it's like you die and then you just restart yeah. either from a checkpoint or from the start. Yeah. Sorry, I'm on Reddit again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. So I haven't kicked that addiction? <laughs> no, never. <laughs> I did for like a whole year and then I slipped back into it. Mm. It sucks, yeah. Same as like I stopped having energy drinks, but I've slowly uh, felt like that um, again. I used to, become a, well, it used to be like immune to them. And now like I had them and it was just like... <laughs> <laughs> like the whole thing like kicks back in again. Sorry, you mean you built up the tolerance to yeah. it? And, yeah. And then all of a sudden it's like... Oh, we've done yeah. I have that with coffee, like, it just doesn't do anything for me anymore. Mm. I need to take it off a notch. 157 mm. treasure. By developing a Coke habit. <laughs> yeah. Coca Cola can give you a kick in the pants. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Coca Cola. <laughs> Don't I have Crash 2 brainstorm this too? Do you? Yeah. Uh, I will kiss you on the lips if you do. I. Okay, I do have it, but back the fuck off. Yeah. He's taken. He's in a committed relationship with his hand. <laughs> fuck uh, you. Yeah, that was uncalled for. And it wasn't classy, but I, I just felt the need to say it. It wasn't classy, so you went straight for it. Mm. Speaking of not classy, Donald Trump. <laughs> Good yes. God. is the president of the United States. He is. The Derek Hulu. It's, uh. It's exciting. <sighs> it's it's, just, it's weird. Like, <laughs> I just feel like it's a tragedy. A tragedy. It really is. Ugh, could he be that much worse than Bush? Uh, yeah, but remember George Bush? Uh, <laughs> remember that guy? Yeah, Mr. 9-11. <laughs> Mr. what? Mr. 9-11. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what he called himself. 9-11 did Trump. And the You know he used to get he, get he still gets a lot of flag for that um that thing that happened on 9/11. How like he was at like a kid's school. Yeah. Like when it got told. Yeah. He, he was reading a, a book to the kids and like someone told him, and he, he kind of like you see the shock on his face. Yeah. And then he keeps reading. It's Wait. like no, your your country's on fire right now. You need to. No, no, I disagree. I disagree with you there. What? Because like if he just had this massive reaction, like on camera then that would have been a huge, like, double victory for the terrorists. He doesn't need to cry in pee's pants. He just needs to say, okay, kids, yes, he does. kids I have to go. I have to do grown-up business. Not sit My there country and... needs me! Yeah. <laughs> Not sit there and still read about the, the goat. Uh, okay, maybe um, saying that there was something to deal with would have been a good idea, but... Like, well, okay, that's, that's too what, big that's, of a reaction. That's what he, he, said, he said, I didn't want to alarm the children. Yeah. Which, you just say, I've got, got grown-up work to do. 
Kids don't agree with that, though. <laughs> I mean, I, I still think George Bush was just way over his head. Mm. In way over his head. Yeah. No, I don't. Like I've that. just killed two of them. Why are you explaining it to me now? He's just reminding you. And that's the end of that level. Oh no, but there's more people to save. Yeah. Uh, nah, but that's how cl that's like how quickly you like. <laughs> It's almost like tank controls, but not really. Mm. No, just the camera's a bit messed up. No, it's just like when you like try and turn it, there's a bit of a delay oh. where he doesn't turn really tightly. Remember when games had tank controls? <laughs> mm. yeah, sp speaking of Resident Evil... <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> um, I like the first three Resident Evil games. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I forgot this is the one where you can do the, um, the triangle hover. It just drops straight down. Yeah, uh, is it? Not, I think there's a ledge to the left. Yeah. yeah. This one. Fire. Mm. What's your opinion on fire? Good or bad? Good. Fire is pretty. <laughs> fire, pretty. Um, it's also cheap. <laughs> affordable to working class uh, families. That <laughs> reminds me, like, um, you know how you talked about 9-11 before and Bush being, like, uh, dumb about it. <laughs> Can we not have you about seen that? the, nah, have you seen the tweets, like, from, like, oh. some idiots that are like, oh my god, China's, like, 12 hours behind, um, America, why didn't you warn us about 9-11? Oh, yeah, sorry. no, sorry, Australia's ahead of, uh, America, yeah. Yeah. That's everything? No. <laughs> yeah, that was a tiny level. Yeah. Were there actually people in this? Like, that must have been a joke. What? The, like, places are ahead of us in time. Always. Oh, I'd hope it's a joke. Yeah, like, I mean, surely. <laughs> Speaking of jokes... We are out of time. Time is up. We will see us next see time. Goodbye, on... Ron. Bye-bye.